Hi friends and families. We are going to sing our hello song together. Find a spot that you can move your body. Hello, hello, can you clap your hands? Hello, hello, can you clap your hands? Can you reach up high? Can you touch your toes? Can you turn around? Can you say hello? Hello, hello, can you stomp your feet? Hello, hello, can you stomp your feet? Can you reach up high? Can you touch your toes? Can you turn around? Can you say hello? Next, we're going to have story time with Miss Elena. Bye, friends. Hi, friends and families. So now it is time to read a story. So this week, we're still working on spring. Um, and we are going to read a book about letters and Canada. So let's begin. A is for Arctic. Look at all the Arctic animals. B is for beaver. C is for Canada. D is for dog sled. E is for evergreen, a type of tree we have here in Canada. F is for flag, and these are all the flags of the different provinces and territories. Can you find Alberta, where we live? It's right here. G is for goose. H is for Hockey. Lots of people play hockey in Canada. I is for Inukshuk, a sign of friendship. J is for July 1st. That is our national holiday, Canada Day. Sometimes there's lots of fireworks and people will carry flags or wear red and white. K is for Ooh, look at that. It's a kind of boat. It's called a kayak. L is for loony. This is our loony. It has a loon on it. It's a kind of bird. And a loony is worth one dollar. We also have different coins down here. Toonies, quarters, dimes, and nickels. So that's our money. M is for maple. And maple trees are where we get our maple syrup from. A lot of you like putting maple syrup on your pancakes and waffles when you were at school. N is for Niagara Falls. And Niagara Falls is in Ontario, where Miss Elena used to live. O is for Ottawa. And Ottawa is a city in Ontario, and it's also our country's capital city. They've got really big buildings, and in the fall time, the trees turn different colors, and it's very beautiful. P is for, what kind of bear is this? It's a polar bear, and it looks like it's got some baby polar bears called cubs. Q is the next letter, and Q is for Quebec. And in Quebec, They've got lots of nice old buildings and really great things to do outside too. R is for railroad. In Canada, we have lots of railroads. Some of them carry people and some of them help carry things all the way across the country for us. S is for stampede and the stampede happens right here in Calgary. Ooh, look at this one. T is for totem pole. Look at that. So beautiful. They're very big and tall and they've got a lot of nice carvings and sometimes they're painted too. Really nice. U is the next letter and U is a word for uniform. So in Canada sometimes we have different kinds of uniforms. We've got a snowboarder and she has her uniform on. Hockey players have their own uniforms. 
we have an RCMP officer, so Royal Canadian Mounted Police, and they have their uniforms. And we also have soldiers or veterans who have their specific uniform. V is for voyageur. W is for whale. So we've got different kinds of whales. We've got humpback whales, killer whales, orcas, lots of different whales that you can see off the coast. Probably have to go to Vancouver though to see them. X is for explore. So explore starts with the letter E, but it, X is the next letter. So there's always lots of things that we can explore in Canada because our country is so big. And Y is for the Yukon. And Yukon is one of the territories in our country. And it looks similar to Alberta maybe, because look, I see some mountains. I also see some people camping. But the Yukon is a place that would be really cool to explore if you got a chance. And Z is for Zamboni. It's a big machine that they use to help make sure the ice stays nice and flat and safe for people to skate on or play hockey. Awesome. The moose and the loon say goodbye. All right, we'll just have our goodbye song and then our video will be done for this week. Bye friends. Hi friends, this is Mishiwa. What a wonderful story, ABC Canada. I learned so much. I hope you did too. Friends, now it comes to our goodbye time. On the count of three. Three, two, one. Circle time is all ten. All ten. All ten. Circle time is all done. Now it's time to go and play. Bye friends. See you in our next video. Have a good weekend.